What's going on, Sneakerheads? It's me, Badger Kicks, Kicks, coming at you with another video for our channel. Today, I'm going to be covering sneaker bots on just sneaker releasing sites and why they're such a pain in the butt. Alright, so really, just. I don't like sneaker bots at all. They're just annoying. I mean, just the fact that you can't buy shoes. You have to, like, wait. I don't know. There's a very good chance you won't ever get a pair of shoes due to bots. Like, my friend Duke has gotten serious, serious, really lucky <laughs> with sneaker sites and stuff like that. Like, he's copped two, two pairs of shoes, two really nice ones he tried to resell. I think that on both of them, nobody nobody bid on them because he was trying to um, put them on eBay. A little, little bit of a markup on them, but still, uh, I just bots. Are, that's so unfair because people can just like, all right, setting up a bot. I don't have to worry about this. So the bot will just do the work for me, and I just make everything more inconvenient for everyone else who's trying to buy sneakers. Come on, like seriously, please. It's just I know people are making money off of this too, and it's just like. You're basically making a. You are making money off of one of the most frustrating things for sneakerheads. Other than, like, trying to buy creases and stuff like that. Which I covered creases in the last video. So be sure to check that out. Link in the description to that. And also, there'll be a card up in one of these corners. So, yeah. It just. I don't know. I. Uh, I don't know. It just. And people are trying to combat this, like they're trying to put more things in place so it's more complex for the bots, so they can't just like figure everything out whenever they're putting in their information for the shoe. Like raffles, raffles is something that they definitely, that's something that's helping a lot. It's just, it's, I mean, you, you put your name in, put your, all your information in, you have several days to do so, so you just like wait and hope and get the email that you can buy the shoe. So yeah, I mean, it's just, I don't know, it's, that's, I'm, I'm happy that we're able to fix it, but I wish we didn't have to do this in the first place. I wish that we were just able to have the regular sneaker drops. You wouldn't have to worry about possibly getting the sneaker unless if it's just like manual. Because there's such thing as being too late, but like really logging on 10 seconds after the shoe releases and it being all sold out. Come on. Come on. It just. Ah, oh, it's so frustrating. I don't know. And it just. There's no reason for it. It's just... Ugh. I mean, I get... I, I know, I I am a pretty big advocate on life isn't fair, right? And I just think that... It's... I realize that that's frustrating, that um, life wouldn't be fair because people have bosses and people don't, and... Um, I don't know. I feel like it would be more fair if people were able to just manually put in their information... And then, I don't know. It's so frustrating. Yeah. I mean, and if you really think about it, like, with bots, it really almost kind of slows the business down as well. Because it just, I don't know. People, I mean, people aren't able to necessarily interact with the customers at all because it's just robots, right? And it just, it also just, it ruins it for everyone. I don't think that they should be a thing anymore. But... I don't know. Here we are. It's just frustrating, you know? I, I just... It ruins the businesses, and it ruins the people's attitudes, because I'm like, just, I can't do anything to stop it. What am I supposed to do? You can't do anything. All you can do is buy bots. That's that's literally all you can... It, it's the sad part. Or be a nice person and try to put in your information like a regular person and try to not use bots or just don't use bots in the first place really i mean there have been several things put in place like there's things something for tickets to concerts and stuff like that they set a law out where you can't use bots to buy tickets and then there was also one thing wherever it was like is in 2018 they tried to have bots stop buying black friday deal like Christmas presents, presents and stuff like that, but it just that those bills kind of died. The, the second one did at least, and it just I don't know. It just makes everything worse. <laughs> I don't know, and it's not illegal, but it just it also viol it violates the terms of privacy, not or something like that, terms of service or whatever it's called. 
for the certain sites, and it just, I don't know, it just, I don't know, it's just uh, frustrating. <laughs> yeah, but that's my opinion on sneaker bots and why they're such a pain in the butt. I just don't think anyone should use them because whenever doing something as enjoyable as buying a pair of sneakers, I feel like you should have a chance, you know? So, yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to let me know. Drop a like and comment as well. Just what your favorite part of the video was, or maybe this is something I missed out on that you want to add. I don't know. So, yeah. See you guys in the next video. Peace.